hold up, I am on my way I'm in motion Let's go to the ocean Yeah, let's go outside We can hang out on the beach without freezing Yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas time Good morning guys, welcome back to the vlog. So today is day seven of Vlogmas, if I'm not mistaken, yeah, I think it's seven, it'll be seven. But we aren't doing much. I'm sitting here editing the video, which is what I do every morning. I try to get it done first thing in the morning so that I have the rest of the day to do whatever my heart desires. And usually I feel good in the morning and sometimes if I wait, I risk starting to feel bad. Like if I eat something or pregnancy, you know, sometimes you just feel bad. But I think we're gonna try to make a wreath today with the ugly Christmas tree that Mauricio bought home, brought home the other day. Um, because we don't want to really waste it, but like this Christmas tree is so spiky. Whenever, I've never had a spiky Christmas tree and when we went to Lowe's to get this one, I was terrified to touch them because I was like, what do they do? Do they like change the type of Christmas tree? But these probably come from like North Carolina and stuff and then those, that one we got came from New York. So maybe they just have different style of Christmas trees. Well, New Yorkers are always pissed off, so. <laughs> But we're gonna go to the store and also I want to see if they have like Iron on vinyl that's like Pattern like Christmas pattern like if they have plaid or something because I want to make like a little like make a Christmas sweater but I Don't know. I don't remember if I saw them have that or not. I'll have to look on Michael's Website because that might be our best bet to find the base for the wreath too. So we'll see let me do this this morning because I think Carly wants it. I don't know if that's what she's trying to tell me, but I literally, she has water, so I don't know. But she's getting the big cookie today if it's big, so we're going to six. Come here. Oh, it's big cookie. It's big cookie. This is what it was like for oh, Dixie. For the, for the dentist stick? Oh, yeah. This is what the dentist stick looked like the other day with the corrupt file. But it was, uh-uh. I dropped it, but it was red instead of green. Okay. Come on. Come here, Harles. Harles. No, Harles. You get the good one. She's like, I don't really care which one I get. Sit. Guys, stop moving. Ready? Gentle. Gentle. Good girl. Gentle. Gentle. She can't reach it. Baby. <laughs> we are going into, I don't know if you would consider it a town pace. It's like where all the stores are because there's no stores where we live. So we live in Milton where the base is and there's like no stores here except for like a grocery store. And you have to drive like 20 minutes to pace where all the stores are. Is that going into town? I guess so. I feel like that's like super country. Like we don't live that far out in the country, but we just live super close to the base. So I don't know, we're going there. 
And I mentioned yesterday that we were picking up, or I was trying to get a halo bassinet that I saw on our marketplace, which like I just described, we live in a pretty small town. Mm -hmm. This is a town. Yeah? This oh, is a town. Oh, oh, yes. yeah. So we live in a pretty small town. Well, there's a lot of military. So the swip swap page like has hit or missed days and I check it almost every single day to kind of see like what kind of baby items or home items that they have specifically I was looking for a dresser, a swing, and a halo bassinet. That's what like the three things that I was like eyeballing looking for. And I found a halo bassinet yesterday and the girl was selling it for $50, but she wasn't responding and like at she, all. yeah, like it took her all. I messaged her at like 10 in the morning and then she messaged me at nine last night saying, oh, can you meet tomorrow? Because I had said, oh, I can meet you today. And so at that point I was just super frustrated. I was like, whatever. So this morning I woke up and she had messaged me back and I responded saying, yes, I can meet her today. And she asked me if I was aware that she, they, she wrote that they had, there was some stains on it. And I said, yes. And I asked her where they were located and if she had better pictures of the stains. Well, she never responded to me. So I went back on the marketplace, just like checking like I normally do. And there's another bassinet on there the better model one with the buttons I don't even like no I wasn't really expecting to get one with buttons like I just waited but actually Mauricio liked this bassinet when he saw it at once upon a child and she was selling it for $30 $30 right so the upgraded version for $30 instead of 50 with stains on it for the other one but the only thing is it doesn't have a mattress but we both we talked like me and Mauricio were talking about like you would change the mattress anyways if you were I would we probably would have changed it like bought a new one it's like 30 bucks from like bye bye baby and I'm pretty sure we can buy it from like Target maybe I don't know but we're going to Jacksonville specifically so I can go to bye bye baby so and spend time with family I guess but the main reason is so that I can go to bye bye baby because there's none around here the closest one is three and a half hours so we might as well just drive to Jacksonville see some family yeah that's five hours away and see family and yeah so that's like what we're gonna do but anyways that's a steal so I feel super lucky today that that happened so we're actually going to pick it up real quick yeah. well, today is a better day than yesterday's <laughs> 20 mishaps well it was it yeah yesterday in the day in the Christmas tree I feel like Vlogmas has just shown all the flaws that we have. I feel like, okay, so we found out something was wrong with Lilia's kidney. Then we had the Christmas tree fiasco, which is not life or death scenario, honestly. And it was pretty funny. And then Mauricio had a really bad day yesterday with his gingerbread house and the smoker breaking. So hopefully today is a better day. But he only works one more week and then we you have leave again. Yeah, I'm only for eight days. Yeah, so he can get through and he works nights which he likes to do i don't like when he works nights i like to i like when he goes to work in the morning and then he's home in the night at night i don't like when he goes to work in the afternoon and works into the night i definitely don't like when he closes but it's not as bad because you don't close at one anymore and it's yeah, not an hour drive me. yeah but we're just going there to pick up the bassinet i'm so excited and she said she's going to throw in some diapers which you don't say no to diapers so and they're like they're still packaged so it's not like nasty diapers. yeah they're like still in the plastic wrap so we got a steal we got the halo bassinet and now we need to deep clean it because it has some stains on it so hopefully we can figure out how to like clean it we got borax and oxyclean to do like the the TikTok. the TikTok thing, if you guys know what that is. So I'm about to do that.
stripping her bassinet cover, like the cloth in it. And Mauricio wanted to strip our towels. Fair warning, it's gross. This is like all of our towels. And the water is like black. Like, <laughs> like this is disgusting like and i feel like we wash our towels quite frequently but there's also a mat in here and yes this will be thrown away this mat in here is like also probably part of the problem because it's like the bathroom mat and then also we have a cup of couple of cleaning towels in here um so those also are probably contributing mostly to this but once they sit here and soak just like i'm doing with her passionate i'm going to wash them in the um washer machine and then dry them and then put them away but the water is nasty it's black yeah it's like black but i was saying like there's the mat and there's cleaning towels in there so it might not be your actual like it's our towels <laughs> It might be, I don't know. But we're about to make our wreath. We got everything to make it. Did you grab this stuff? Uh, I need to go to the laundry room. Um, we went to Michael's and picked up stuff to make a wreath. And for this bag. Hold up, I am on my way. I'm in motion. Let's go to the ocean. Yeah, let's go outside. can hang out on the beach without freezing Yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas times We'll be chilling and having a good, good time Doesn't matter if the snow is falling Or the wind blows in the rain is pouring It will always be Christmas in here is our finished wreath. Um, considering it's handmade, it's not bad. Or handmade, homemade. Homemade, because all wreaths are probably handmade. But it doesn't look too bad. It's a little wonky, like, <laughs> like right here. But I think it turned out pretty cute. Hopefully it stays together. The bassinet is finally clean, and now I'm ready to put it all back together. We took it like super, super apart in order to get to that. So if you're not willing to take your bassinet like completely apart, It'd be really hard to clean, but it did come out pretty clean. Honestly, it wasn't even that dirty to begin with, but we feel better now that it has been stripped and clean. So now it's time to put it all back together. You and I, we never show emotions. We just keep it down, down inside. Yeah, you and I Both longing for expression For the things we like But we stay quiet, we stay quiet. Hold me now We finally finished putting it together and it literally takes up the entire side of my bed. Um, but it works, everything works perfectly and it actually like looks super clean. I don't see any stains or any marks on it and all the buttons work. All right guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog right here. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye guys.